Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel, and uh, two questions I want to answer about Microsoft Edge. Uh, one is about the slider that should appear for RAM usage. So if you go down Edge, you go in the upper right corner, the three horizontal dots, Settings. Um, there will be eventually, it's still not there, if you go into System and Performance, a slider for RAM usage. And uh, no, it's not there for a lot of people yet. So there's no problem there. It will be in the manager performance uh, area here. So it's not there yet. The second question that came is about the performance detector. What does that do? And of course, they say when it is on, the browser detects tab performance issues and recommends an action to fix. Well, this actually does work in a lot of web pages. I've noticed that it does things that you just have nothing to do with. For example, I was on a page that had a lot of ads and one of the ads seemed to actually bog down the web page. So the ad actually disappeared and it said this ad was removed. And this is Edge actually doing it. Edge looks at the performance of what's happening in a web page. And if something in that web page seems too heavy or too problematic, it can shut down that process of that area in a page to make the rest of the page faster. And sometimes, actually I've seen it do it a lot of times where some ads are removed because they just don't give good performance. So it's um, it does work. Sometimes there'll be a pop-up. The pop-up will say, well, this page seems to be you know having a hard time uh, really running. Do you want to fix it? Sometimes it's going to ask you if you want to fix it. It doesn't work always. Sometimes it tries to fix it and it might crash the page. But it tries to do something at least to have that working. It might warn you sometimes of tabs. If you open another tab, it might say, well, there's this tab is very heavy. So, um, you know, you might want to shut it down for battery life or things like that. And it also uh, depends on whether you're using a laptop on battery or a desktop, powered desktop, because it won't uh, react in the same way. So if you're on battery, it will be a lot more proactive because it wants to try to get yourself the best battery life in the laptop. So it might block more things on web pages. But it is, it is somewhat interesting and it does work. Um, I don't know if Chrome has anything like this, but this does a certain job. And um, if you are using Edge and you notice that some of the ads are removed, it says that this ad was removed for performance or something. Well, this is a performance detector, just looking at it and saying, whoa, this ad takes way too much power. So that's what it does. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.